Hello Gemini, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading for February 2021 for the sign of Gemini. So let's get straight into your reading Gemini and pull your overarching energy or message for the month. So what do we have for Gemini please? Angels, Spirit's Guide, what is the message from Spirit? So I'm going to pull a few Oracle cards first. We have Let Go and Enjoy, that is a message for you. What else do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guides for Gemini for February 2021? Thank you. Message for our lovely Geminis. Thank you, February 2021. Oh, that flew out, so let's go with it. We have Be Proud. It's time to celebrate all that you have achieved and all that you are and all that you will become. Every once in a while, it's important to stop and acknowledge what you've achieved and to be proud. And that could be very much going with this let go and enjoy kind of energy. Sometimes we focus on the negative, don't we, rather than actually acknowledging our achievements. <clears throat> okay, so. Message for Gemini, please. Angels, Spirits, Guides. Message for Gemini. And it is for February 2021. Message for Gemini, February 2021. So I have number 15, eternal union, new love is forming. You know, that could, you know, it shows a couple there. So for some of you, it could well be new love or new phases of love. It can also be an energy sometimes for me as a reader, self-love. It can be like the lover's card, you know, which can be connected to your higher self, self-love. So... Let's pull some more cards and see what else we get. What do we have for Gemini, please? Angels, Spirits, Guides. Message for Gemini. Okay. Wow, we've got the Raven. Prepare for change. Archangel, Archangels, Azrael and Bokpi. So prepare for change. So I'm going to pull three cards, Gemini. The first card is the message from Spirit. The second card is what the message pertains to. And third card is action or advice, final action or advice. So... What do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guides for Gemini? What is the message from Spirit? Message from Spirit for Gemini, thank you. February 2021. Message from Spirit is the Five of Coins. What it pertains to, Six of Coins. And final advice we have the fool okay so I'm gonna I look to the bottom of the deck so I'm gonna put it down Gemini I have the star there as well card of Aquarius it's interesting both of those are kind of Aquarian energies um, very visionary energies you know um, and also liberation energies as well, which feels very beautiful. So there's a message here of let go and enjoy. You know, sometimes, you know, there's this kind of energy, certainly in this kind of energy that you might be experiencing of, well, it is what it is right now, so I can allow it to keep me down or I can just enjoy you know and there's this kind of energy of reconnect to self be proud of my achievements and what i'm capable of and know how i can bring it feels like better things into my life because you know they're holding which is interestingly enough the peacock feathers and the peacock is a sign of abundance which is interesting if you're talking about money and career which i feel you are here it feels in this situation 
we have new love forming now here's the thing Gemini what I'm seeing in this yes this could be just a message for you in terms of new love you know when we go through difficult circumstances it might well be those that mean something to us those who are our rock when we feel we, when we go through unstable times the love deepens and it can be that kind of energy um it could well also be and again I did reference the lover's energy which can be about partnerships it can be about somebody coming into your life a bond between two people you know it feels that kind of energy so there may well be some establishment of a bond with somebody it's interesting that I'm getting that because you are being told Raven prepare for change yeah change is coming and it feels like positive change the advice from spirit spirit acknowledges that you're feeling lack you know the five of pentacles can be a card of financial loss or negative changes in your finances money career you know and this can be a card of feeling the lack needing to ask for help needing to ask for charity whether it's to do with the state whether it's to do with family you know i mean it can well be about asking for help here uh, or needing help it is the card of of also a self it can be sometimes about begrudging you know um if there is somebody who has made you feel the lack you know it feels in this kind of energy there could be some begrudging to them you know certainly in terms of money career finances maybe somebody took care of themselves and you know you were left out in the cold it's that kind of energy so spirit is saying even though you are in this situation even though you feel that lack you're still being watched over by spirit and that's what spirit wants it to what to, to tell you you know this is somebody who stood outside a church and you can see the glass window there the warm light shining on this person in their darkest times you are being watched over and guided so that's what you're being told here Gemini and I feel that's what this, the message from spirit is for you because the six of coins again it can feel it can be a card of a feeling lack um it's the breadcrumb energy you know not having enough but this is also a card of you're going to get what you need because this is also a card of spirit saying you will get what you need if you put your energy and effort into the right thing you know there's something about changing the way you're looking at something as well you know even though you feel like this is about be proud of what you can achieve what you're all about of your talents experience knowledge and there is definitely this energy of just change as much as you can that energy because the pentacles is very much linked to law of attraction what you put into something is what you get back it is that cause and effect kind of energy here and the universe is saying if you put your energy in the right direction and you might well be doing you know already this is an energy of you are going to get what you need so just keep keep going there because the fool is with the star I mean the star is a card of hope isn't that beautiful it's also a card of divine wish fulfillment you're going to get a blessing um this is a card of dare to dream don't lose sight of your hopes and dreams here and I feel for some of you this very real energy this earth energy things are very real in this situation you know um you might have lost sight of those hopes dreams and wishes and this is a card of dare to dream don't lose sight of your hopes and dreams because whether you know it or not what you're putting your energy into now has the potential of hope um there is hope at the end of this journey and you might find new hope this month uh, so that feels really beautiful because this is a card of you're on the right path and you are being blessed guided by god the universe the divine the star is a sense of renewal it's a renewal of self as well reconnecting to who you are your truth you know and also you know as this person almost kind of like floats on air you know there is definitely an energy of believing miracles so and what is their hope with well a new beginning that liberates you from this 
And the fool is real optimistic energy. So it feels that there's new hope with some kind of positive new beginning. This is a freedom energy. So freeing yourself from whatever it feels like the reality, the difficult reality of this situation, you will soon free yourself from that because there's new hope coming your way. So that's what you're being told. Now, again, I've already explained this message, but there could be somebody, a bond that you're making with somebody this month that is bringing that change. But I definitely feel for some of you, Gemini, the new beginning is coming. There will be reasons to be, I mean, both of these cards are optimism energy. So I definitely feel for some of you, there is greater positive hope, optimism coming your way. Just keep putting your energy in the right direction and you will get what you need. Now, I will always say, I'll say with this card, what you need isn't always necessarily what you want. <laughs> but it's always something positive when you receive it because it's a blessing. Yeah. So let's pull you a final card. Final message for Gemini. Final message for Gemini. Thank you. We have take the time to pamper yourself or let others take care of you. Number 22, ask for help if you need it. You know, it feels that kind of energy. And it's interesting, Gemini, because I'm also getting this as something that could be holding you back from asking for help. The message is, if you need help, ask for it. Ask for it. Um, I, I feel that, you know, there'll be people who, who are there will be help provided you'll get what you need so yeah i hope you enjoyed the reading gemini if you did please do like share and subscribe i hope it's a wonderful month for you all and i will see you next time thank you